Hi everyone, how are you guys doing? I hope you are fine and rocking as always. This is Shila Sapan Matre. Welcome to my channel. Today we are going to see what urgent message Archangel Michael wants to give you. So you have three options over here. Option number one is this beautiful orange candle. Option number two is this lovely selenite crystal. And option number three is this beautiful rose quartz and amethyst bracelet. So you can either go by what you're drawn towards the options in case if you're confused then you can also have this kind of uh, numbers on three pieces of paper one two and three close your eyes and say dear Archangel Michael God and Goddess what urgent message you have for me and then pick up any one uh, number whatever number comes that's going to be a pile some of you have been complaining your subtitles are irritating as well then you can remove it over here there is a cc button just click on that and the subtitles will be gone magically <laughs> of course because of youtube now um let's start your uh let's see what archangel michael wants to tell you hello group number one how are you guys doing i hope you're fine and rocking as always so today we are going to see what urgent message archangel michael wants to give you so let's start with this beautiful orange candle you've chosen this particular candle that means you have been stuck with something maybe some paperwork or some opportunity which you have been waiting for and you are kind of in between and you're really praying to Archangel Michael to make it happen. That's what I'm getting from this candle. I also see that Archangel Michael wants to tell you to take action in order to bring your dreams into fruition. So let's see what urgent message Archangel Michael wants to give you. Oops. I feel that... Uh, you do pray to Archangel Michael in a very purest form. I can see a picture or a statue uh, in my mind's eye of Archangel Michael. And um, I see a beautiful candle lit in front of him. And... Um, you know this this particular picture or statue this presence even though it may not be very big in size it looks very big okay like the energy is very huge and um, you have this special connect to Archangel Michael is what I'm getting now let's see the cards one by one the Empress the first message that Archangel Michael wants to give you that you are the creator of your own life you are a co-creator of course the divine archangel michael is there to help you you have a very very distinct life purpose uh, and uh, you need to focus on your life purpose as well the life purpose could be parenting could be uh, being abundant uh, or it could be something to do with women okay so yes your life purpose is very important also archangel michael is telling you that if you are, have been praying to him uh, regarding your mother or you being a mother he is uh, hearing your prayers and he's saying that do not give up hope uh, just keep your faith high he's also saying that you are going to receive abundance Wow, you've got four of swords. So here, Archangel Michael wants to tell you that you've been so focused on creating uh, projects and to taking care of everybody, nurturing others that you have forgotten to take care of yourself. So Archangel Michael wants you to focus on your sleep. He wants to, you to focus on taking a break, taking a pause and resting because that's very important. That's the next message. Ace of Cups. So Ace of Cups and Empress, definitely the ones who have been praying for a baby. I can see that clearly with this combination. However, you need to rest as well because you've been very stressed about it. Also, if you do not want a baby, and like she's like, I don't want a baby. So 
be careful in that case secondly you could there will be a new emotional uh, happiness coming your way as well could be marriage could be addition in the family or an extended family also there could be birth of a creative project so here archangel michael when i combine these three tarot cards i can clearly say that archangel michael wants you to rest so that you are ready to create ready for this new beginning that the divine is going to bless you this new opportunity coming your way which is going to bring in a lot of joy and abundance now let's see what your other cards are telling us uh, before i open the other cards let me tell you i am coming up with angel guidance workshop and in this workshop i will be teaching how you can obtain uh, archangel michael shield how you can protect yourself how you how you can protect others as well via via distance and in person protection methods all right so let's continue with your cards the first card is let's see let's see this particular card law of attraction so here archangel michael is telling you that you need to focus on law of attraction somewhere you know over the time you know that law of attraction works and it has worked for you however you're not really working on it i feel like you stopped visualizing is what i'm getting earlier you used to spend quite a good time visualizing because i because you had time and now you have become so busy that you don't even have time to do visualization but you need to start and surround yourself with positivity that's your next card decide to be happy now so many a times in pursuit of our goals uh, you know we forget to be happy and grateful for what we have today and when we don't do that our vibration becomes low and our law of attraction becomes goes in an opposite direction so decide to be happy now so that you can manifest amazing things let me keep your card over here let's your next card pay attention to your dreams so archangel michael is communicating with you via your dreams so you know many a times when we sleep we forget you know uh, what we dreamt about when we get up so keep a dream journal next to you so that you can write down whatever your dreams that you saw so that you can later on throughout the day you know uh, get some clarity on it all right but pay attention to your dreams not only the dreams that you have when you sleep but also to the dreams that you have in your heart all right next is ask archangel michael to help with the situation so clearly uh, there is a situation going on right now what i can see is you want to manifest something really very big it is with regards to abundance love and personal growth as well So for this you need divine help and archangels god and goddesses can help us only when we call them for help because of the law of free will so call upon archangel michael and he'll be more than happy to help you in this situation this is so beautiful let's your next card third eye chakra i did tell you that you used to visualize but somehow now you're not visualizing also you get a lot of messages via your third eye so you get a lot of visions you and you are quite clairvoyant or maybe one of your clairs is really very develop, developed so use that use your visualization pay attention to your dreams also third eye chakra talks about dreams so again you have, you have been asked to pay attention to your dreams and law of attraction also means manifest what you desire and don't pay attention to what you fear i'm not asking you to put your fear under a carpet acknowledge your fear but don't give too much energy to it by constantly thinking about it helpful people so here archangel michael is telling you that whatever your dreams are he is going to send helpful people to uh, kind of you know manifest your desires also for your dreams you will need support for your dreams to get manifested you will need help so do not hesitate to ask for help uh whatever your dream is it will happen via a friend via a contact or via support this is what your cards are telling us now let's see uh, what your yellow cards are telling us we'll also see your other divination tools like wheel of fortune and angel numbers as well okay Let me keep my card over here. I'll just take some picture messages too, since. 
parents wow so clearly you know here with the ace of cups and three of empress somebody is going to be a parent okay the ones who are like i don't want to be parent either like, why why do i always get that well if you have children archangel michael is going to help you with uh, you know by becoming better parents at the same time you could also uh, pay should pay attention to your parents okay parents in heaven uh, if your parents are in heaven they're sending you love they're asking you not to worry about them the ones whose parents are on earth pay attention to them you got oh your yes, smile and shine again this is uh, you know resonating with decide to be happy now so what smile and shine basically means that if you decide to be happy now you are going to be in a very high vibration and that will attract more good things here smile and shine means focus on your blessings as well let's your next card you got sunflower okay so this particular, uh, you know, for some of you have offered flowers to Archangel Michael, which is saying he loved it. Also, uh, he is saying that you will, you should surround yourself, you know, with flowers in order to, you know, be um, in a good frame of mind and clear your energies as well. Stack paperwork getting complete while shuffling the cards. I believe I no. When I saw your candle, I did tell you that some of your work has got stuck, or your dreams have got stuck, or some something in your life is got stuck. So your Archangel Michael is telling you that yes, it will get complete. Do not worry. Let's see what angel numbers you have got. Let me just pick up some numbers. Okay, I'll pick. Oh, you got four angel numbers. My God, you got a number in angel number fifty-five, which means positive change is going to come in your life. You got the number one zero, which means creator loves you and pay attention to your dream. You got the number 56, which means positive change in your material life and spiritual life. You got the number 76, which means that you are on the right path, especially with regards to balance between material uh, goals and spiritual goals. All right, let's see what your wheel of fortune is going to tell us. So think about a question group one and let me spin the wheel for you. Oh wow, you have got yes. So whatever question is, the answer is yes, group one. Lovely. Group one, I hope you enjoyed this reading as much as I did. If you did, do hit the like button, do subscribe to my channel if you are guided. Also, the workshop link and the earlier participants' experiences is given in the pinned comments. So have a look at it. Take care. Bye-bye. Hello group 2, how are you guys doing? I hope you are fine and rocking as always. Today we are going to see what urgent message Archangel Michael wants to give you. You have chosen this beautiful white selenite crystal which means that you have been really working on your vibrations. You really are very conscious to keep your vibrations as pure as possible. I am also seeing unicorns in my mind's eyes so maybe somehow some of you are trying to connect with them. Or you're connected with them or you may have something unicorn around you or maybe you're wearing a unicorn uh, outfit right now or maybe something about unicorn okay so i also feel that um i feel that you have been really ascending to uh, you know higher vibrations is what i'm getting i'm also hearing the word merlin uh, so maybe you're connected with Master Merlin in some way. Now let's see your cards one by one. What message Archangel Michael has for you? Message one. I feel that somebody has been a little toxic to you lately and you've been really irritated by that. Uh, do not base your value or the value of your work by the toxicity of this person okay just ignore them i've al already removed your cards so we'll see this as well so let's see your first card ten of swords so the so archangel michael is saying that you have been lately quite stressed okay a burden stress you need to delegate your responsibility I also feel that there is a possibility that somebody who was a support system for you has kind of 
uh, gone on some break and you're worried that how are you going to manage things do not worry god always sends support okay uh, so stress uh, archangel michael wants you to give your worries to him and stop stressing so much all right second message is queen of wands so your archangel michael is telling you that this is you you're full of energy you're full of vitality keep your confidence extremely high archangel michael also wants you to pay attention to yourself self care is extremely important archangel michael is also saying that you have this ability to manifest all that you desire there are two sides to you one is a victim and one is uh you know someone who can create magic okay so uh he's saying that the victim part of yours needs healing agreed but you do have the creator part in you as well so use that to create magic and a woman is going to help you let's see four of pentacles so archangel michael wants you to stop being such a control freak you have been trying to control everything and all that is also leading you to a lot of stress you know so he's asking you to understand that you know at times when we let go of something we manifest it faster okay this controlling nature is not going to help you also he wants you to focus on uh, balancing expenses and savings now let's see what your cards are going to tell us okay you are on the right path archangel michael is telling you if you're stressed about your path if you're trying to control your path if you're doubting yourself understand that you are on the right path you are where you should be okay so don't get frustrated that i'm am, am i behind behind am i lacking somewhere everybody's in a, everybody's ahead of me don't give energy to that all right shield yourself again this is talking about uh no now also when i see over here i feel that some of you are taking stress because of the negativity around you there are people around you or there are news around you which is worrying you so you need to shield yourself now here i would like to say that i um uh, in uh, angel guidance workshop my upcoming angel guidance workshop i teach cord cutting i teach uh, protection in person and distant i also teach a very powerful archangel michael prayer and there is an archangel michael meditation which i also share with the participants in case you want to know more details about the workshop click on the link given in the pinned comment all right so yes you need to kind of shield yourself from toxic energies or stressful energies Your God, you and your loved ones are safe. So again, see, you know, you. So what happened when I see these three messages? What I can clearly see is that you're really worried about your life purpose, your career, where your life is going. So your Archangel Michael is asking you to shield yourself from your anxiety and the energies that you're creating. Okay. Also, shield yourself from outside toxicity. People telling you. when 10 people tell you oh my god the economy is going down the economy is going down or you know this is happening that is happening you tend to absorb those energies so stay away from those energies understand that is their reality not yours by that i do not mean that we should just ignore the global uh, thing that is happening but please understand in every economic fall down there is there are always people who grow right so not everybody is doomed so don't give energy over there if we all we all are connected consciously when we all consciously believe that yes good things is hap good things are happening and good things will happen we are in the energy of positivity and of course we are just not going to be daydreamers we're going to take action as well let's your next card earth angel so here clearly you are a light worker you have been born on this earth to help mother earth so when your life purpose is to help mother earth and the inhabitants of mother earth then why do you need to worry because you are divinely supported you are divinely guided and you are you are really taking efforts to make your and everybody's life better even if it is in a small way please understand it is making a big impact all right 
and it's your next card you got don't stop so here the angels are telling you that don't stop don't give up on your dreams archangel michael wants you to continue because you're on the right path somewhere i feel that you've been working really hard but you're not seeing the results to you know results and that's kind of frustrating you you're like you know what's happening why is it that my uh, prayers are not getting answered why is it that uh whatever i'm expecting is not happening okay so don't worry whatever you are praying it will happen okay trust in divine timing stay true to yourself all right so your uh, archangels are telling you that listen trust and follow your inner voice you do not have to kind of you know undermine your ideas you do not have to be like you know what maybe i'm not good enough so i'm not getting the success no it's not that way okay there are people around you who are observing you they may not appreciate you but they're observing you and they are they are seeing your progress okay so you shine in your own light do not wait for other people to you know give you that focus that focus light okay you shine your own light you are light yourself remember that now let's see what your other uh, divination tools are going to tell us also to move some other myth messages Okay, and let's just throw in some angel numbers as well. Okay, so let's see all of it one by one. We'll first do the yellow cards. Take action. So here, Archangel Michael wants you to take action. If you have been sitting on something and procrastinating, he wants you to take action and bring it to fruition. Finding what is lost. So here, Archangel Michael is telling you that it looks like you know something that you are lost has given you a lot of anxiety. So rather than focusing on, you know, uh, oh my God, it's lost. Focus on how you can retrieve it. Okay, and nothing is lost in God's eyes. So just pray to Archangel Samuel uh, to help you to find what is lost. You got over here time to check that you are still making yourself happy. So make yourself a priority. Okay. make yourself a priority you always take care of other people's happiness focus on self care first i drink the coffee then i do the things which means first you pay attention to your own uh, self okay and then you focus on others and whatever you need to do fun adventure and sport so your archangel michael is asking you to bring in some fun in your life you have been so stressed and so worried about the future that you have stopped living in the moment okay so be in the moment enjoy the moment that you are in you got over your number 75 and number angel number 46 the angel number 75 is talking about that you are on the right path just like archangel michael's message and a positive change is coming your life in your life the number 46 is telling you that the angels love you and you are going to balance spiritual and material life do not worry so this are your messages let's see what your tada wheel of fortune is going to tell us so ask a question to archangel michael and let me spin the wheel for you you got trust so whatever your question is you need to trust that archangel michael will answer it in a way that is for your highest good okay so group 2 i hope you enjoyed this reading as much as i did if you did do hit the like button to subscribe to my channel also uh if you're guided do uh, visit the link of the workshop given in the pinned comment take care bye bye Hello group 3 how are you guys doing i hope you're fine and rocking as always you have chosen this beautiful rose quartz and amethyst bracelet which means that you are truly focusing on balancing your energies 
you are very uh, intuitive at the same time you are very wise as well and you're really focusing on taking decisions which is driven by both your heart and brain when both of them are in sync that's when you believe that a decision is right now let's let's see what your cards are going to tell us let's see an urgent message from archangel michael for you um i see a crystal a amethyst crystal so you are very wise okay and you get a lot of downloads divine downloads you are working uh, like somewhere ideas are very important for whatever you are doing creativity ideas so let's i've already removed uh, the angel cards for you let's see death and rebirth so here archangel michael is telling you that it looks like you have been through a very difficult uh, time in your life okay and uh, that has kind of really um this transformation has been very painful and traumatic and you have been trying to heal through this trauma so archangel michael is hugging you and telling you that he is there with you he is understanding uh, the pain that you have been through and you're going through and is telling you that throughout this entire uh, transition he is with you holding your hand so do not worry you got the strength card he is giving you strength he is also telling you that you have lot of power you are extremely powerful you are extremely strong he is asking you to tap into your inner strength all right let's see number 3 ace of pentacles so your archangel michael is going to send you a you know he is going to send you a very amazing opportunity in terms of money in terms of career he is asking you to kind of focus on the opportunity and not let go of it he is also telling you that you need to focus on uh, abundance okay and positivity of course that does not mean you need to be toxically positive which means only focus on the positive aspects and just put all your uh you know painful emotions under you know some sort of carpet no we have to heal our pain pain that we have uh, we have been put through or we are going through uh at the same time we also need to believe that there is lot of inner strength which the divine gives us so archangel michael is with you providing you strength providing you opportunity as well i also see the presence of goddess energy with you let's see write about your thoughts and feelings i i believe with this card that you used to write about your thoughts and feelings maybe you were journaling but now you are stopped uh so you need to re restart okay restart uh this entire journaling process lean on god and angels for support so yes you have been through painful time but god and angels goddess are supporting you they are asking you to lean on them to trust them okay they are hugging you so i see a lot of support with you you have got admit the truth to yourself and act accordingly at times we try to run away okay from our feelings from uh, being honest about a situation about a relationship so your archangel michael tells you that yes this transition is going to be painful okay but if it is required if it is for your highest good then you should you know uh, think about it of course uh, do consult the right professionals before you undertake this transition you are a powerful light worker worker so here you know again this is power and over here also we have got strength card which talks about power so you are underestimating yourself you are kind of you know letting an experience weaken your belief in yourself you are very powerful and you and you you know but at the same time you know how to use your power you don't use your power to suppress people or to throw off you know your throw your weight around you use your power to make a positive difference in your and other people's life 
let's your next card get more information so clearly archangel michael is telling you that before taking any decision ensure that you have all the information required to take the decision classes so i believe this could be that you are a teacher and especially with the strength card so i feel that you are into training and teaching also this is telling you that you need to learn uh, education learning teaching is your highest calling all right and you need to pay attention to it now let's see what your cards are going to tell us the yellow cards i feel a lot of opportunities are going to come your way you could be a mentor a life coach a trainer a counselor an influencer so now success going to come your way new beginnings and be ready to adapt and be flexible okay you cannot stick to your old uh, paradigms and beliefs all right before i open this card i would like to tell you that i am conducting angel guidance workshop in which i cover all the 18 archangels i also cover how to connect with archangel michael how to invoke him how to obtain his shield of protection how to protect yourself and your loved ones and how to cleanse spaces as well to know more details about this workshop click on the link in the pinned comment now let's see your cards so the first card your vehicle and moving on so archangel michael uh, maybe you prayed for a vehicle or uh, you want to move on from this painful transition so he is assuring you that you will move on oh you got four cards lovely oh my god look at this i just removed this card in front of you and this i removed before but look at the coincidence okay you got classes and learning and education so clearly learning and education is a very important part of your life purpose and your purpose to be born on earth so pay attention goodbye so i feel that some of you have lost a loved one and that has been a very painful journey for you however at the goodbyes are you know they are there with us it is just that we cannot see them but they can hear us and we can also hear them have you felt you know like you do feel when you interact with uh, you know when you when a loved one pass passes over at times it's so difficult to believe that they have, they have moved on we feel that they'll come at any moment of time hug us talk to us and we can feel them around us okay that's because they are present around us in the form of loving energy okay not like ghost okay you got passion intimacy and pleasure so uh archangel michael wants you to kind of you know uh, maybe you're um holding yourself back for some reason or you're wondering you know that will i ever get intimacy pleasure or passion so archangel michael is telling you that unleash the uh the energy in you of course uh that does not mean you cheat on your partner or something okay it can also mean that maybe you need kind of you know um uh, some sort of push in that direction as well okay now let's see stop waiting for permission to be who you want oh my god that's so powerful so we our heart knows what we desire to be okay like before i came into this profession my heart knew that i'm supposed to assist a um, lot many people but i did not know how i was trying to find answers how am i supposed to make a difference how am i supposed to you know assist people how do i do it and i never knew that my whole life the divine was preparing me for my life purpose so yeah don't take you don't need permission so when i shifted from corporate to uh spirituality there were so many people uh, who were so sure they were like you were doing so well why did you even choose this what is wrong with you but i was like i will follow my life purpose i will follow what i've i've what have been born to be okay 
that's your next card you are worthy here the arch your archangel michael is telling you do not doubt yourself see something has made you doubt yourself your self worth please understand don't doubt your self worth you are much precious than you can ever know you got over your vintage and timeless you know it's written your vintage is timeless style i feel you know that some of you are worried about aging some of you feel that you know you may lose your touch you may lose your uh you are successful right now but what if in the future you may not be as successful so don't let all of this doubts affect you i also feel this fear of aging needs to be removed from your uh mental space age is a number all right just a number at the end of the day it's a mindset now let's see what your angel numbers are going to tell us let's see what these numbers are wow you got the number 81 so maybe you are a combination of 8 and 9 or there is a presence of 8 and um or nine in some way the number 81 is telling me that keep your thoughts regarding abundance positive because what you think so shall you show you will attract the number 42 is telling you have faith you are supported by the angelic realm the angelic realm loves you now let's see what your wheel of fortune is going to tell us so think about a question for archangel michael and let me spin the wheel for you you got maybe now let's understand why it's a maybe why is it not a yes if you wanted a maybe then it's a different story why the answer was maybe oh the answer was maybe because you are not sure you are like am i ready for it will i be able to do it you know you feel that the entire world is against you okay you're just tired you're just tired of drama trauma you're like you know what i don't want more drama in my life i'm done with it my patience levels are giving up so you need to kind of understand that you are in this bubble of energy you are safe and protected and you know, even if people are irritating you they're not going to win okay because a divine force is protecting you all right and don't worry you are supported by the divine and whatever is this that you are asking for but you are afraid to receive it all right group 3 i hope you enjoyed this reading as much as i did if you did do with the like button to subscribe to my channel and do uh, if you feel like also go through the link of my upcoming angel guidance workshop once year workshop like all my workshop link in the pinned comment take care bye bye